Today let us learn about HTML5 clipping paths. Here we have our canvas. Below that I'll insert an image with the help of img tag. We already have an image called technotip.jpg inside the same folder as the index.html. I'll make the display property to none because I don't want to show the image besides my canvas. I want to actually show the image inside the canvas. So here is our image. Our canvas has a 2 pixels black dotted border. Also note that it's a 400 into 400 pixels canvas. To uniquely identify this image tag, I'll give it an ID called myimg. I'll get that image tag using the get element by id method and store it inside a variable called myimg. Now by using draw image method I'll display the image on my canvas at from 0, x -ax 0 pixels x axis and 0 pixels y axis that is the origin so it fills the entire canvas. Now let me, by default, the entire canvas itself is a current clipping path. But let me reduce that path to an arc. For example, here I am drawing a circle, complete circle at 200 pixels x-axis and 200 pixels y-axis with a radius of 180 pixels. I'll just clip that circle this circle and show the Im image only inside that circle that only inside that clipping part so this is how clipping paths work you could you could draw the clipping path randomly using using some lines we have already learned how to draw some paths which is not a rectangle because for rectangle we have fill rect stroke rec and all but for other shapes like triangle and other polygonal shapes we don't have any methods so directly we can draw like this for these videos please visit technotip.com and our html section so clipping path is a region inside which drawing takes place outside which drawing has no effect any path can be a clipping path, any path for example, uh, just now we showed a random path, also a circular region. So any path can be a clipping path. You simply draw the path as normal and then call the context clip method. With this clipping path, it restricts drawing to a particular area on the canvas. So this clipping clip method will be useful while developing some applications which manipulate the image, cropping of image or selecting particular area inside an image kind of stuffs in your image applications. Please share this video with your friends on Facebook, Google+, LinkedIn, StumbleUpon, etc also like this video on youtube please stay subscribed to technotip.com and to our youtube channel don't forget to like this video on youtube